YouTube. I'm back with another tech unboxing for you. And today I have another laptop for you. It's like a laptop week. Um, and again, it's in a boring brown box. Boring brown box, boring. I can't pronounce that really quick. It's hard. Boring brown box. Um, this one's slightly less boring because it's got a picture on it. But still, tablets come in nice boxes. So why can't cheap laptops come in nice boxes? Asia, all your other companies, get that sorted. But this is what we have. It's the Asia Aspire. I'm just showing this everywhere. Um, E11. Um, and this is the E3112 model um, and I'm again I'm going to do lots of videos showing how to do upgrades on this as well um, and you can pick it up for £179 but enough of me chatting, well there will be more chatting but um, let's get to the unboxing. Okay so here we are in for a closer look and it, it's a boring brown box and got that one a bit better that time but like I said it's got a picture on the front just to sort of side bring the laptop, you can't really tell what the laptop looks like from that but there you go um, and with AC E11 on the side, what we've got on the other side here we've got some specs and stuff which I'll go through in a minute and then again just some numbers and nothing on the back as well slightly boring brown box but i found my opening tool finally after looking for it for months how cool is this axe no it's not gonna let me do it that way get in it so this laptop is an 11.6 inch laptop and it comes with the um, Intel N2840 which was the same one in the Lenovo G40 that I unboxed earlier in the week how do we get in this and that processor is at 2.16 gigs and it bursts to 2.58 and I really can't figure out how to get in here oh here we go here we go I'm Screwing this right up. Put this on my worst unboxing ever pile. That is difficult. That could stress you out. So, as well as being an 11.6 inch laptop, the display anyway is LED and it's a 13, you know, the 66 by 7681. I always forget that number. Yeah, 1366 by 768. Um, it comes with 4 gigs of RAM, which is upgradable to 8 gigabyte, which we're shutting in. So here's some manuals. Again, and it's also got a 500 gig hard drive, which you can upgrade to an SSD, which we'll show you a video for. It's got all your typical sort of Wi Fi's, um, not AC Wi Fi, but BGN, gigabyte Ethernet. And then we'll show you the rest of the ports when we get around it. So let's open the box so I can stop talking and get back to the video. So we have, let's put the laptop down. We have just a power brick. Pretty standard, that's what you expect to see. And the cable looks long. I would say the cable looks long. We'll go with that, that's a good measurement. Um, and talking about other measurements as well, oh, it's in a nice little bit, nice cloth as well, which is always good to have until you've got yourself a case if you want to put it in a bag or anything. Um, and this laptop is very light. It weighs at like 1.38 kilos because it's my, for my friend that's going traveling and she wanted something light for her bag. Um, as you can see, it's finished in silver, but it's also available in black and, I think, pink. Um, it's not metal. But it has got a real... It's got that sort of metal look finish to it. And on the back here, we have the ports. Just let my camera focus. So we have the um, port for the DC jack, your gigabyte Ethernet, a USB 2.0, a USB 3.0, and a HDMI. And that's the reason it's on the back is to give it, I imagine, a really thin profile. Let's go to the side here. Let's take this bit out. This side here we have an audio jack, an SD slot. And that is about it. Let's have a look at the bottom. Just some screws and um, what looks to be um, a speaker here and some nice padded feet and another speaker on each side as well. So stereo speakers. And if we open the laptop up. And we see again, it's finished in a really nice silver chiclet pad and a very nice size track pad actually. Very nice size track pad. It's, and then here as well, it's um, fanless quiet computing, so it's going to be nice and quiet. So anyone that just wants to do a bit of audio recording as well, just using a bit of a reaper, this could be very useful. Skype certified, but to be fair, it's got a camera, it's Skype certified, precision touchpad and the gigabyte LAN that we went on to. Just some small specs, Intel inside. And here is, I'll just prop up the camera a little bit. Here's the 11.6 inch display, no metal here, would it be nice to get this in metal or at least a gloss black finish. I know it picks up fingerprints but it would have looked a lot more premium to do that. And then we have a camera as well, I'm not too sure about that, um, the specs of what that is but I imagine it's not going to be too good, maybe do some HD recording but I would probably, if you want to see webcam, just get an update anyway. Upgraded one, 
There we go, very nice, very slim looking laptop. I think my friend's going to love this. I think anyone out there that's watching my channel that's going to buy it would love this too. So please go over to my channel um, if you want to know how to upgrade this um, and how to get into it because I'll be uploading all those videos within the next week. Thanks for watching.